So let's add Ross to our Ubuntu UR sim install. We might as well use Edge, it was there. So we've got Google, ROS. We're interested in Ross, we're actually interested in the Ross Industrial. But we'll just go for there. So let's see. Ross 2. Now the Ross 1 and Ross 2 are different. Um, not quite sure <laughs> which one is which. But I think someone's got to do with real time support. And the interesting thing here, of course, is, well, looking at this, we can actually have it on either install it in Ubuntu or install it in Windows 10 by the look of that. Okay, so here we go. So we've got Ross 1 will give us Ubuntu. Uh, we'll target is targeting Ubuntu, um, which is what we've got, 20.04. And now we have Ross Foxy Fitzroy. So let's see the difference between the two. Which one do we want? Ross or Ross 1 or Ross 2? I'm not sure. Why is Ross for me? Distributed, modular. Let's try and find out what's the difference between Ross 1 and what Ross 2 is. So that's these two. Okay, so we need to we still need to know the difference between Ross 1 and Ross 2. What's gonna what's gonna give us that? Options. Okay, so these are the old LTS ones. Well uh, What's the difference between Ross 1 and Ross 2? Okay, well maybe just do a a Google search. Let's look at uh, this. Okay. Not sure. Let's try a different search. So that's ROS1 versus ROS2. Which should I install? Okay. So answers to ROS or in ROS org. Or ROS answers. Right, this looks like I want to go for this. There are two answers. Someone's asking which one should I install? Should I start with ROS2 or ROS1? ROS1's not going to be developed anymore. Okay, ROS2 would be a good place to start if you're just starting, just now starting. Okay. Uh, okay, someone said comments, disclosure. Almost zero documentation and tutorials is a major pain point with ROS2. Okay, so that's a negative for ROS2. As opposed to the fact that ROS2 looks like it's future-proof. Uh, ROS1 is also a trial-by-fire experience, getting up and running. Hmm, okay. I'm not quite sure if anything's really solved with this. Looks like we're on our own, folks.